Uh, how do I start this off? Yo, what's up? I asked you guys on Twitter a while back to send me your best platoon clips and you guys delivered with 400 replies. 400 is a lot. That's like an, uh, that's a crazy amount of clips. So obviously I looked through all of them and I picked out a couple really good ones that I want to show you guys today. The first clip we have here is just so, so rude. This clip is both hilarious and very sad because the roller is just trying so hard to get up that wall. He is like, there is something on top of that ramp that he just needs to get to and he just wants to do his job as a roller, but this explosion just comes in and is just ruining his chances. <laughs> And I love how he immediately turns around and comes at the explosher, but rolls over the explosher's teammate instead. If that's not justice, I don't know what is. You know, it's like our dentists say, you need to brush at least two to three minutes a day. Uh, and if that doesn't work, just pull out your stamp and finish the job. You know, when this map came out and they said they were going to release it for the uh, private battles, I was like, this is exciting. I'm going to find a way to glitch these things and make it so you can fly super far across the map. Little did I realize an infinite beam of ink does that job already. And someone's obviously achieved that. The best part about this is like imagining the enemy team like in the middle of the map. And then this inkling just flies over your head and zooms across the map. And I feel like when this update comes out and they release this map for private battles, there's gonna be so many good things that come from this. Hey guys, what do you think would be a good uh, color for this Splatfest? Let's try and do something we've never done before. What, what do we take inspiration from? Uh, yeah, uh, what do you think about uh, liquid sh Well, that's just goddamn brilliant. And don't get me wrong, those are some decent roller kills, but they vaguely remind me of flicking Nutella off of a butter knife, which is a, a little unusual. What Splatfest was that? If anybody knows, tell me in the comments, because that's... First off, th like, three of them were on the tower. Three out of the four of them were riding the tower. And I guess the fourth one was on his way to get on the tower because he was like right within dynamo shot. Maybe they had this like group mentality like, oh, they can't take us all down, except that they did. This next clip is a, a glitch related clip. And if you guys have glitches, please send them to me because I love looking at them. They are so cool. So immediately a couple questions. One, how do you even get to that part of the map? Two, why is that part of the map solid ground? Because no player is supposed to be out there, but the developers clearly made that a platform that you can walk on. And three, that is a big jellyfish. It's more of an observation than a question, but I felt it was necessary. I kind of want to do this myself because I really want to get out there and get a better look at that jellyfish on the unicycle. That is, that's a hidden gem right there. I was, I was kind of expecting him to get like a 360 or something, but, uh, but that didn't happen. Oh, nope, never mind. It's a 360 with two kills. Man, you really had to have your cake and eat it too and lick the spoon afterwards. Why would you be eating cake with a spoon? I didn't think that through. <laughs> All right, guys, I need, I need a new Splatfest themes, a completely new color scheme that no one has ever seen before. Hey, how, how about the, how about watermelon? That's goddamn brilliant. <laughs> you know, I, I respect the charger for making that shot, but it is physically painful at this point to watch a canceled splashdown. I mean, it, 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 it hurts to look at. This dually dashing is so good, it could legally be considered teleporting. I mean, he's like an Enderman in rain. He's in there, he's gone. Next time he's over there, then he's over there. Oh, what's that? He put the clam in and got a score. Now he's gone. I'm sure he makes it look easy, but maybe I should start using duallys. <laughs> Not.
you know those videos on like Instagram and Snapchat and YouTube where people are like playing with slime or like cutting a soap bar or like squeezing that green foamy stuff and then you know what I'm saying with like glitter and stuff it's like really satisfying to look at nah it's I, get get rid of that I don't want that this now this is the good stuff right here who what who is this person in my chat there's someone in my chat right now I've got OBS open and I'm looking at my chat and there's just a dude that's like hey everyone who there's no dude there's no one here do you think he knows? Anyways, this clip. Um. It's sad. It's just, you hate to see it. Okay, all right, now you're just flexing. This is what all of us dream to accomplish as charge remains, but I think none of us have actually achieved, except for the rare few that are in these clips. Okay, hold on, hold on, wait a second. Wait a second, can't do that. Am I supposed to believe that he's riding the ink rail? Is that, is that what that is? Is he supposed to be riding the ink line? The lag is so bad that it, it skipped the opening sequence and went straight into combat. So where you can, you can see the inkling like spawning and starting up while you're in first person getting ready to battle. And it just looks like the inkling is just like, I, I, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do it. Yeah, I'd be, I'd be pretty confused as well. Oh, okay. All right. Okay, I can die. I can die because I know at no point in my life am I going to ever accomplish something like that. This is a 720 no scope double kill. Holy I mean, the person who made this clip must have fainted after making this shot. Like they made the shot, they fainted, and while they were fainted, their brain was just like, you gotta save this or else no one's gonna believe it. So they pushed the button. But I'd like to imagine like if the person didn't clip this and they just had to tell their friend, yeah, I got, I, so I got a 720 no scope double kill. They'd be like, are, are you on drugs again? You're on drugs again, aren't you? Oh, that's what you get. I think everybody who gets squid flopped or taunted after they die, this is what they see in their mind like, oh, I'm gonna, oh. but in this case, this guy was like, oh, oh, oh. oh we'll see a salmon run clip. This is rare. You don't, you don't see a lot of salmon run clips out there. Don't you ever get that feeling where you're so excited after beating a tough, brutal three-wave salmon run game, and you're just you're so thrilled that you just start doing cartwheels into the sea, and right as you're about to hit the water, your Nintendo online service expires. That never happens. That never happens, and it's what we all wish would happen. Life's not that simple. Wake up. And then just right back into it like nothing happened. What even happened just then? What am I looking at? That's a splatter shot. The splatter shot did all of that. They must have all been so weak from the other teammates that he could just and then they would all there's no other way. That's amazing. That's just that's impressive. No, I'm not. No, no. Okay. All right. Here's the thing. You had me with the with the quad kill. Pretty cool. Team wipe with the splatter shot pro. I'm impressed. You th you threw it in the garbage. This next clip is like really impressive, but extremely unsatisfying at the same time. He gets a, a triple kill with a single bomb, which is amazing. But the the fourth kill is an assist. Which means he he was just like inches away from getting a quad kill, but some other teammate stole it from him and then died because he's the only person left in the entire map. So, so cool. Now of course I saved the best clip for last, uh, so brace yourself. And he's off, ladies and gentlemen. Obviously he's done with this battle. Time to just move on to his next.
If you like this new format of video that I'm doing, let me know because I'm trying something new that I've always wanted to do. So if you enjoy this type of video, tell me in the comments, drop a like, whatever you want to do. Huge shout out to this guy that sent me a literal Splatoon hair clip. Um, I mean, that's hilarious. Okay, I think that's that's enough for the video. We can uh, we can end it there. <laughs>